I'm going to record to the cloud. So I'm Tiana Smith here with InspiredMommyBoss.com. Today is just a really uh, fun, chill, ask me questions, uh, day one kick up of this five-day Facebook boot camp. And if you're not already, if you saw this link somewhere else and you didn't already join the five-day Facebook boot camp, I'll actually put it over here in the comments or maybe somebody else could for me. I think I'll do it really quick. I, I just want to make sure everybody on this comment and put it in the chat box. I, Let's see if it, it'll work. I put in the chat box the Facebook group just to make sure um, that we do that. Now, I'm going to try streaming it one more time because I got an alert that it might work now. So we're going to give this one more go. Um, and so right now, in a minute, what I'm going to cover is this. I'm going to cover what to expect from the five days and then for sure where to go to see your analytics and insights. And I'm going to share with you where you're going to look for your daily videos. So it's kind of like a housekeeping thing. And then I'm staying on here. I allotted some time. I'm going to answer any questions. So those of you who showed up live, which is a lot of you and you're awesome, um, I'm going to answer your questions because on Friday there are prizes and that's our celebration call and it's actually like an official really big training on Friday. Like not big, like scary, like big, like awesome. Like what do you do at the end of this? You know, I want to give you these tools. So today is an impromptu, fun, ask me questions, anything. I'm going to walk you through our housekeeping. And then we'll go from there and I'm going to share with you my screen of um, like our Facebook group and how we're going to be using it. And if you don't already have a Facebook business page, um, I'm going to share with you like how you can do all that. That's in day one's video. So this thing is thinking about going live on Facebook. Again, post where you're coming in from. If you haven't already, post any questions. You can post your questions as you're thinking of them. I'm going to get to every single question at the end, even if I don't um, see it right now. Like I'll scroll back up. So if something pops in your head while I'm explaining all of this, please put the question right there in the comment. If you're shy, you can even make it just to go to me, but I promise you, if you have a question, somebody else has the exact same question, I promise. Like, you guys are probably already seeing that. So you can put it in the chat box just to me. So let's do this, let's get started right now. And streaming live to Facebook is just not working, so. It's cool. Let's go. All right. So I'm going to share my screen. Let's start by doing some housekeeping about, first of all, welcome to five day Facebook bootcamp. Welcome to all of you showing up live. You're the people, you're the go-getters. It's probably going to be one of you that wins the award this week, but let's make sure of that, right? People who show up live, you're my people. Okay. Like amazing. And now I know some people I am going to record this and it is recording will, um, you know, main or be at work and stuff so it's still your chance to if you're watching this in the replay I'm not totally mean but I do think there's something about live and making it happen that's all. okay so with that said welcome Awesome job, you guys are my go-getters, my action takers. I'm so happy to see you. Um, again, please feel free to put in the comments so I can go back through this, who you are, where you're from, and what your goals are from this. Just put it right here live over here on the side, and any questions you're having, I'm going to answer those. Who am I? If you don't know much about me, my name is Tiana Smith. I have my company, inspiredmommyboss.com. You can go check it out. I've been doing media and marketing for a long time. I did a uh, marketing in uh, Sony Records years ago, and then I had my own record label. I got my master's degree um, eight years ago, and then I had my own company. I started at that point like a media and marketing company, and um, through all these years, I've served hundreds of entrepreneurs, run um, ad campaigns, and um, social media marketing, even organic traffic for big celebrities, six and seven figure uh, entrepreneurs, and I've helped startup entrepreneurs grow their business. So no matter where you are, today if you're a brand new beginner or if you've been doing this and you're just feeling frustrated and you want some more encouragement, wherever you are right now, I'm going to show you tools that work for wherever you are. That's part of my promise and guarantee and we're actually going to be able to track that. So let's go and do some housekeeping and then I'm going to show you how you can do your screenshot and qualify for our awards on Friday. On Friday, I'm going to be picking one winner and it is based on the analytics and you want to show up live Friday if at all possible um, because you'll get extra prizes. Everyone who shows up live, I'm going to have an opportunity for a big uh, prize for you. But the winner of who goes for it is going to get a $25 Amazon gift card, my freedom planner, and my selling whistle program, which really teaches you how to get people offline from what these skills I'm teaching you and how to close a sale. So you're going to get over $500 in prizes and some little cash from the Amazon gift card because that's always fun, right? I want you to get something good for yourself and think of me fondly. Think of me. Think of me fondly. 
lovely when we say goodbye, but hopefully we don't say goodbye. By the re for the record, also, if you don't know this about me, I'm a professional musician. I started in the music business, and I sing things, and I don't even think about it. So if you hear me singing, I may not know that I'm singing. I've heard that I sing. I know I just sing, just so you know. I am aware of that. Okay, so keep post posting your questions over here. I see them popping in. People from New Jersey, California, Michigan, Illinois, all over the world. This is so amazing and exciting. Okay, you guys ready for the screen share? Type the number two in the comments if you want to go and see what we need to do this week to get you on track and see if you can win. Two in the comments. Oh, we got Canadians, Ontario, Canada. My mom is Canadian, by the way. I've been to Canada a lot. I've been to Nova Scotia and PEI for all my Canadian friends on here in North California. Awesome. You guys are cool. So right here is our group, as you can see, okay, our five-day Facebook boot camp. I want to just make you aware of where you're going to find your stuff, okay? Number one, we're going to get to these rules in a second. Um, there should have been a post today. Let's go see if it posted my um, one scheduled post. Oh, let's go see this post, and let's go edit post. And we're going to reschedule post to go like right now. What time is it? 11.10? Let's do it at 11, 12 a.m. Um, 30 minutes? Fine. Let's do it at 11.45 a.m. So you guys will see this today, and this is what your action steps are, okay? I, I, was, I meant to send that at 5 a.m., and it got scheduled for 5 p.m. But part of this is you're going to learn this week how to schedule posts. Not today's video, but if you guys stay right here, this is where I, I said I can give you a heads up for all the people who show up live. You're going to get a little leg up here. Okay. Day one, Facebook Biz Bootcamp. Every day this is going to be posted. It's going to be in the discussion, and it'll be to the announcement. So if you're checking this from your phone, you'll see that post come up first. I'm going to set it for 5 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So um, anyone, whatever one you're in there, let's go invite this person to the group. Let's make sure Lauren gets to be in here. Okay, so coming back to the discussion here in this post, what you're going to do is look for this post every day, okay? There's only five. Remember, it's five days, guys. I'm telling you, schedule what time it is that you're going to do this, okay? Number one is schedule this in. Today's action steps, you can watch the video here. You'll go to this link every day. You're going to have a video that's already pre-recorded. This is different than what I'm doing right here. Today is kind of like behind the scenes. I'm going to give you these strategies, but go watch this video today. I'm going to try to keep them between five to nine minutes long, keep them under 10 minutes, and then it'll take you 10 to 20 minutes to implement it, depending on how fast you are and how familiar you are without them teaching that day. It could even just be a post, but I'm really wanting to give you things that are going to change your business. Number three in the comments, if you can commit to 20 to 30 minutes a day this week, checking the post and implementing. Three in the comments if you're committed. You're making this commitment publicly. Okay, awesome, seeing them all pop up, okay? So that's one, is you wanna make sure you find this post every day. This will be posted at 11.45 today. It's not letting me, you know what I'll do? I'll just do this. Let's just take care of this. I'm gonna go options, download the image. I'm gonna delete this post. And then I'm going to come over here and I'm going to post it right now so that you guys can see it. And for anyone who runs Facebook groups, is um, you, you can um, schedule things in, as you see. So we're going to be talking about that for Facebook groups and Facebook um, pages, how you can schedule things. So this post is up there. I'm marking it as an announcement. So this is ready for you guys right after this call. I just want to make sure this is available for you. Okay. So it's right there. Okay. Part two is every day is you must come and let's go to our rules now. If you go to files, so you guys type the letter F in the comment for files. Okay. I I'm super helpful and I like to be super helpful. Um, I've been teaching people for 18 years. Um, my Since I started, I've been a teacher and a coach. So I'm very into this. I know what systems, I know it's good to ask questions. Okay, you guys are in, I'm so excited. Let's go over our uh, rules and then I'm gonna show you, it's all right here. Do you guys see this? You go to files and it's right here. You can download it. And so these rules are fun rules. It means you're qualified. Now, you don't, if you don't wanna worry about a prize, why would you? It's don't even worry about it. Just go for it. You're going to take a screenshot of your in insights, which I'm going to show you that in a minute. You're going to schedule in this call, which you guys have done, and make sure you schedule in our Friday call. I also put a Wednesday call in here um, if you guys want that. You're going to schedule in the time to watch and implement your videos daily. It's a 10 to 15 minute watch and a 15 minute implement time, okay? You're going to post three times a day on your Facebook business page. This, if you don't do that, that's fine, but you're not going to win. So that I'm putting that there as a minimum of how many times. You want to pick a specific number. I am allowing boosted posts, but you cannot spend more than $20. So um, you can win without spending the money. 
I've seen people do it. Um, but if you wanted to boost a post and try out some of the Facebook ad boosts that I'm going to be teaching you in this program, uh, probably on like Wednesday or even tomorrow, I might, and today I'm going to give you a little heads up. That's why I said you, you showed up. Type the number, lip, just type yay, Y-A-Y in the comments. If you're excited to stay tuned once I get done explaining for a little heads up on your post, your schedule, and your Facebook ads right now, okay? These are insider information. And then this is just like, a, it's not like a rule. This is more like, this is what you must do. These ones are rules. You just got to post your insights and you need to come in, um, comment on every single post every day. So I actually need to go and put that somewhere on here. Let's do... Let's put this as like a, a tip. Well, let's put this as a tip. Oh, I have to edit it. So this is how you edit com comments like this. So I'm going to go edit doc and I'm just going to edit this for you guys real quick to remind you. And um, the Wednesday, there's a Wednesday automation workshop I added. If you want like a down and dirty um, that's in your events, I'm going to show you where all this is. And make sure you post on each daily comment that you completed it. But the point is here, you're wanting to, you're going to show up for yourself. This is like a five day assignment, treat it like school, but in a fun way, school, if you're not a school person, it's cool. The point is that it's right here. Okay. Where, where'd it go? Facebook biz camp, boot camp. You guys see this? Type the number four in the comments if you know where you're going now. You can find this from a phone. Ideally, you want to do a lot of this from your computer first thing in the morning. Hopefully, you have a computer. If you have a computer, do it there. And if not, you can do all this from your phone, though, okay? So this is all here as a reminder, okay? The other thing that I've put here for you guys is post ideas and scheduling for your marketing. This is just a bonus, and I'm sharing with you the best kinds of posts to post that get engagement, okay? Lifestyle, behind the scenes, share a pic of you, your life, your fave coffee, smoothie, give people a sneak peek into your life. A selfie, always good. You want to be smiling or doing something you love. You could be like jumping in the air. You could be like walking your dog. You could be hanging with your kids. Ask your kids permission, by the way. I believe in that. Um, if you do, I, I do. My one son refuses to be on camera, and so it's fine. I respect that. Um, so, but my selfies of me or my dog or my daughter, whatever, make it one of you smiling. It's just proven. Now, sharing is caring. Say it with me now. Sharing is caring. Type the number three in the comments if you're ready to share cool things. Let me tell you right now. Your heart center, the way to do this, to get your heart straightened out here, is to like find cool things you love. This is what I talk about. I follow the golden rule principle with posting. I only share things I authentically really love. You know the golden rule that's like, do to others as you'd have them do to you. Well, I only share things that I would want to be shared with me. <laughs> I love marketing. Okay. Sharing is caring. Marketing, a blog post, lead page you've done that links to you. So for example, I have my website open. Go check it out. It's brand new, guys. I just launched it last week. I haven't even talked about it because I'm in the middle of launching all these other things. This is my new website, inspiredmommyboss.com. If you click on blog, like how you can do this is, um, let's say you have a blog also. You could come over here. You could go click on your link. This is my blog. And then I could come here and grab this hyperlink. Okay, and then I would come into Facebook. I'm going to show you a little behind the scenes of how we do this. Go to my business page. We're going to talk about business pages in a minute. And just so you guys know, I teach about this today, and I could say, hey, have you ever wondered how you can reach more people um, in business online? Check out my free training and article here. And then you do like a little dot, dot, dot. You get the link. Side note. Do not let it be the image. Somebody say it with me. Don't let it be the link. You go over here, you grab a screenshot, even if it's literally this. If you screenshot, if you have a PC, I don't know how to screenshot, Google how to screenshot. Be adults, please. Everyone can Google everything. This is not a place for excuses or babying, but if you do have a Mac, you screenshot by pressing... Shift command four, and that means where you take a picture. Don't take credit for somebody else's picture, but this is my article. So this is where I'd go to publish. Now, side note, you can schedule it right there. Do you guys see this? Type the number S in the comments if you see this. Schedule right here. Schedule it. I'll just schedule it for sure, 11.29. It has to be like 20 minutes in the future, so we'll schedule it. I just did that, and the point is, 
that when you, um, this means when I say post three times a day, this is why you could come here in the morning or you could schedule it out for the whole week, guys. If you had an hour tonight or two hours, you can make sure you get at least three posts scheduled directly into Facebook. Do not use Hootsuite. Do not use MeDagger. Do not use an alternative app. You will cut your algorithm down. It's not worth it. This is how I make almost all my money is through Facebook marketing. Please don't worry about apps. You need to take the time to do this. If I told you, let me look at you straight in the face right now. If I told you by spending 30 minutes a day of authentic marketing where you are providing amazing value, I teach you how to use even basic skill sets with ads that you could bring in six figures, would you, can you commit to this? Seriously, don't do the cheap, a broken approach of, uh, I don't have time for this. If you don't have time for this, then you don't have time to make money online with clients and serving them. That's just my heart to heart for you. Maastricht, talk, Tiana, time, who's in? Number five in the comments if you're like, all right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, let's do this, right? Like it's like shaking like a Polaroid picture, five in the comments, yes? Okay, so I just had to share that thought for you. If you don't have time to post yourself, you don't have time to serve clients and find them. You don't deserve that. Do you get what I'm saying here? It, like, if you say that, then you're, how are you going to attract people? And how are you going to serve them? Because you're not willing to show up for them. People work with people they know, like, and trust. It takes at least six to 12 touches where they see your face, see your brand name, before they may even sign up for a free offer, let alone buy from you. All right, all right, all right, all right. Princella's got me. You got me. I got to, like, find that song really quick. What is it? What is it? By, who is it by? It's by... um. Shake it like a Polaroid picture. It's Mrs. What's her name? Mrs. Uh, Robin? No, it's not Mrs. Robinson. Somebody put that song in there for me. We'll get it. We'll get it. We'll think about it. All right. All right. All right. Okay. So back here, let's come back to our boot camp and finish these. Video. You guys, video is so key. Do you want to know why video key? Who knows that saying that says, um, you know, a picture is worth a thousand words, right? A video is worth like a bazillion. It's what connects you. I know it's outcast. Thank you so much, Kayla. Let's look it up. All right, all right, all right. Let me, let's just get real today, okay? You guys ready for real? It's, is it hey yeah? Hey yeah. Yeah, it's this one. I want to get to the point that's like hey yeah. Now I want to talk to you about this real quick. I know you don't like video because you don't want to see yourself or hear yourself. Type the number seven in the comments if that's why. You don't want to see yourself, you don't want to hear yourself, you're critical of yourself, and you can't stand to see it, and you can't believe that other people would want to see it. Is that what's going on? Okay. Type the number seven. Let's be real right here. All right, all right. We're going to be real. Okay? Come on, guys. Hi from New Jersey. Hi, hi. Why aren't you on video? Tell me in the comments. Why aren't you already on video when you know it can be, if it can fix, if it can fix. I can't talk and sing this song. All I'm thinking is, hey, yeah, yeah. I don't want to rewatch myself. Thank you for being honest. I totally know. I've deleted so many videos. But here's what I know. Do you guys go out in public every day? Do you guys go out in public every day? Come on. Or most days, maybe stay inside. <laughs> I mean, I'm in the she shed right now. I'm inside. And I'm very hot right now. By the way, it's hot in here. Lazy eye. Okay. That's okay. We all have things wrong with us. I actually, just so you know, I do weird things with this eye also. But I just like think I'm awake on camera. Okay. So let me help you right now. We love you. Like, do you guys care that my, like, my hair went crazy today. I went for a run. I don't care. I'm showing up. It doesn't change that I know what I'm talking about. Right? So I do my best. I get what I want done. I think, you know, I, that's what I'm doing. And then I show up and I forget about it all because it's self-centered, right? You're thinking about yourself instead of the message that you have to share with others. And I get it. We're all self-centered and selfish. And it, I know it's like, yeah, but it's, no, there's no buts. You go out in public, you go to the grocery store. Why don't you get on camera to make money and do what you dream to do with life? You guys got to get over it. And you don't have to be fully made up. Just be who you are. You know what? I go live. Like, I did a live stream on my Instagram right after the gym. There was, like, a little bit of mascara there. I did, like, take that off and rewatch it. I was just like, you guys, show up real quick on this live stream. Because what it is is we're getting to know you. And you, we are usually our own worst critics, but we can reprogram that. That's a mindset thing. But I want to tell you. Right now, even if just one person you hear me, like we love you, we don't care about all these things, nobody is perfect. 
I hate the way I sound and look on camera half the time. It doesn't matter because what I'm teaching you to do changes lives. It changes businesses. It changes finances. When you change your business and your finance, you change your life. You change your family's lives. You change their legacy of your children's lives. You teach them that anything is possible. You don't know who else you're going to touch. It is a ripple effect. And you're holding your business back by being insecure and self-centered about the looks or the way you think you look like. Just kill it. It's okay. And you don't have to talk to the camera all the time. You could even just post a little video of like where you're going for a walk. The point is we want to know you're real. We want to know you're not just another name out there with an image on it. It's not about being a model. It's not about being a certain size. It's not about being a certain color. It's not about being a certain age or look or anything. It's about you being you. And you saying, hey, world, here I am. My name's Tiana. My name is D-I-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-
five minutes, get on Pinterest, grab an image, and then even if you schedule two posts a day or three posts a day ahead of time, I recommend as many posts as possible. Okay, commit to what you're gonna do right now. How many are you going to do every day, okay? That's what you wanna commit to. I'm telling you right now, if you want crazy results, post 10 times a day. I'm personally gonna maybe do that with you guys. Um, three is minimum to stay in the algorithms, and that's why I said that. Um, yes, I did not screenshot that. I saved the image. The question was you right click save image as. Now one thing is if it's a if it's a picture though, like this one gives the um you need to make sure you give credit. Just side note, you do need to make sure, and I'm gonna do a training on this tomorrow about like what kind of content. So we'll come back to that, okay? Now over here before we go, let's just review everything. Okay, so here's this is all in your files. Type the letter F again for files. You can click on files. Here's your rules, they're over here. Here's your um, post ideas and scheduling. Make sure you download Pinterest. Just so you guys know, you can schedule all this from your phone. Let me open up Facebook and I'll even show you real quick how you can schedule that. Okay, let's go to Facebook. I'm gonna go to my business page, Inspired Mommy Boss. Let's go find my page. Now from your page, you guys can see this, yeah? That's what the page looks like on a phone, okay? So when I go to publish a post, do you guys see the published post? That's what it looks like. Everyone see this? You gotta scroll down and at the bottom, when you're posting something like, hey, it goes share and it says newsfeed and um, you can press if you wanna publish now, schedule later. So it's under share, that changes sometimes. But um, just so you know, this is all available to you from your phone or a desktop. Type the number two in the comments if you are super excited about all of this and killing it. Okay, so we've been on for about 30 minutes. I'm gonna take questions, but the point is, real quick before we go, last part, and I'm gonna take questions. When you build your business page, if you don't know how to build your business page, watch today's training, okay? This is your business page. You need to go to insights, and you need to take a screenshot of this today. Screenshot on a, on a uh, phone, you can screenshot it from your phone. You need the whole thing right here, okay? You need to post that. You need to come over here to our discussion, and day one, you need to come in here and post it right here. You attach a photo or video, and you come and screenshot it right there, okay? So that is really essential because what I'm doing is when I'm getting your guys' things, I'm going to day one and then you're gonna post your day five results on, on Friday and I that's gonna be on its own thing. I'm not gonna go searching for this in the group and it's you're gonna flood the group. So this is why I'm asking when you're posting things in this group, post it on whatever day we're in. And if you have questions, you can post them here too, but make sure you post your insights. So each day, please find the day post. That way I can find your questions for that day any of your work you're doing that day type the number three in the comments if that totally makes sense do you need me to show it again type the number three in the comments if this is making sense so you go to your insights from your page now if you just start a page today um, that's okay and I talk about that on your training that's today it's a nine minute training you want to watch it and it's okay that it also zero because actually it's going to increase it's going to improve you can see before if you go to photos from this is from the past but people were starting at like zero right like people are at 27 629 that's like day one and then they get to the end and some of these people like one thing so everything goes up radically when you follow this whether you do ads or not okay that makes sense for everybody number three in the comments if that's all making sense okay cool you guys got it okay so that's that's our beginner steps so again to review your steps really quickly okay here's your boot camp day one video it is attached over here in your discussion everything is going to be by day so every day the, the day is going to be pinned this is the place you're going to engage in the group is each day okay come into the comments you can ask other questions post your insights on day one you'll have a new video every day on here and if you're not getting the emails let me know like post a question say i'm not getting the emails if you didn't send up somehow on the email list because all this is also emailed to you every day it should be automatically you should be on my list so that's how we do this type the number seven in the comments if this all makes sense you know what to do you've got some clear direction and you're excited to go and slay it all day this week come on let's hear it 
Let's do it. Oh, jump on it. All right, all right, all right. All right, cool. I feel like we still have to do this really quick. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, we get together. Okay, this is what I'm like all the time, and I love it. I'm like this by myself. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's a next level when I'm teaching a, a live thing, which I love. Okay, so now let's go over here, and I'm ready to take some questions. Are you guys ready for some questions? Let me give you a little heads up. You want some insight? Let me Before I even take the questions, I'm telling you how to get ahead right now. Post 10 times a day, or at least three. Choose three or five if 10 feels too much, and stick to it. You need to be consistent. If you change this up, you will still be qualified to win. It's not about that. It's about you. Make a commitment to yourself. It's for five days. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Again, you could come in here tonight and schedule it all out. There are zero excuses, guys. There's zero. I won't take excuses. I'll delete the excuses. I will call you on your excuses. <laughs> not a mean way, but like, really? That's interesting because this other lady had seven kids and stayed up all night this weekend and built her funnels. So I don't think there's any excuses. You don't need to stay up all night. I believe in sleep, okay? Post 10 times a day, is that what you're saying? Explain why again. Okay, here's why, guys. First of all, three is minimum to stay in the algorithms, the organic algorithms. Um, and then the other thing you want to do is you want to boost a post. Like, this is how you'd boost a post. Right now, I need to pay my ad thing. I'm going to be boosting this later. But you'd boost the post here. And you. one thing is a little side note, and I do put this in your rules. It's already in there. And I'm going to be talking about this on Tuesday and Wednesday more. But um, you, the image needs to have less than 20% text. So if you're like, why didn't my ad get approved? Because it has too much text. The reason that boosting a post helps is it gets your image in front of more people. Okay, so even if you just spend $5, um, you don't have to, but um, if you spend even $5 a month, let alone a week, you're in the top 5% of all Facebook business pages. Uh, why does 10 posts a day matter? Let me talk to you straight. Look, the more you post, the more people see your posts. The more people see your posts, the more potential buyers you have. It's that simple. Cool, make sense? This is, a, this is a matter of throwing out excuses right now because I'm here to help you guys for free and I do this for a living, I do it for my own stuff, I do it for other people's stuff. So I totally love your question, Kim. Awesome job asking it. I love questions. I'm just gonna answer straight is all. Um, if you post 10 times a day, that many more people are gonna see your stuff than one post, 10 times more people. If it's, it, then it's three times as many people, if not more. Because what happens is it starts building in the algorithm, these little bots that are behind the scenes in Facebook, and Facebook's connected to Google. If you have a website, for example, this helps, posting on Facebook helps your website traffic. It's just all linked together in little ways we can't really understand. I just know that it does work and it is proven. Does that help? Now, type the number five in the comments. No, three to five is minimum. Ten is better. Um, if you if you listen to people like Gary Vee and Grant Cardone, it's 10x. The more you post, the more people see your posts. It's just math. That's it. This is a numbers game. Don't overthink it. It's a numbers game. If you want more sales, post more. That's just that. Awesome, Kim. I love the attitude. Um, and commit to whatever one it is. If you want to commit to three, start with three. If 10 overwhelms you, do whatever you're going to commit to. Because part of this process in anything in life where you're building something and growing something is making a commitment to yourself that you're going to stick to. I would rather you post three times a day and, and kill it for five days this week than be like 10, seven, five. No, no, no. It's about a commitment to yourself. So commit to yourself that you're going to do every video, that you're going to post whatever amount that is. But just so you know, if you want to win the prizes on Friday, guess who's going to win? The one who posts the most. <laughs> this is all on a business page. Yes. The question is, this is all on a business page. Yes. And let me share my screen. This is in the, in the uh, thing over here. This is a business page. I'm not counting a profile. Profiles do not count. There's no analytics. It's private. This is on your day one video over here. I go in depth into this. I explain exactly what I'm talking about. So I'm not going to do it right now. You guys need to watch your video today. But um, just so you know, profile is private. That's where you have to add friends. You need, everybody needs a public business page. Facebook also owns Instagram and Snapchat. So you're, you're upping your algorithms all over the world by being on Facebook. And that's why we hone in on Facebook, okay? And it needs to be a business page. You can't boost things. You can't schedule things on a profile. 
you got to open that today if you don't have it to qualify for any of this stuff. And I do post on my profile also, but this is my business uh, page and this is where business gets done. It's like your storefront, okay? I really hate the way I just said the word done, by the way, like done. And this is what I mean about Facebook, like, in, I mean, being live. It's like, you know, we say things, we do things and we're like, oh my goodness, all these people just, I'm like, whatever, we're just human beings. Okay, let's, great questions, guys. Keep them coming. I'm going to answer all your questions right now. Okay, let's do it. This is all on a business page. Yes, Kayla, how many offers do you make a week? Should a number, um, should a certain number or percentage be with an offer? Awesome question, Princella. First of all, if you've not been posting on your business page, I probably wouldn't do one offer until Thursday. But if you're usually been posting, you do not want to um, do, I'm so hot I have to take off this thing because my brain is freezing up just a second. Or it's burning up. It's like so hot in here. Okay. There's that. Okay. So here's the thing. You want one out of six. And I'm going to put that in your notes. You guys got me? One out of six is an offer, but it's not always a sales offer. And I talk about this in more of my training. You want to be on Wednesday's training because this is where I talk about like how to get people on your list, all that good stuff. Let's go to five day Facebook boot camp right here. And over here, I'm going to put that in there, Princella. That's a great one. In your files, I'm going to edit your file for these um, post ideas. Let's go to edit doc and let's go here to number six. It's called a call to action, and you'll hear me say CTA, and this is a post about um, your business, either sign up on my list, link to a free offer, or um, grab a free strategy call with me, um, link to your calendar or message you, or something like sale and give them a post. Sale isn't gonna usually do it. I'm telling you right now, you guys gotta get on phone calls, okay? Let's get over that right now. That's part of why the bonus on Friday is my Selling with Soul program. Um, you don't post enough, but I haven't done offers either. Yeah, so you wanna build value. I, it's this whole thing like, you guys all know, let's be real right now, okay? Let's be real right now that nobody likes to just feel sold to. You don't like to go into a store and then keep coming up to you like, yeah, I'll ask you for help when I need help. I just want to enjoy this experience, right? Like you, you want to enjoy the experience. And then when you're ready, you'll ask for help. Are you guys right? Or you don't want to be ignored either though. There's a, a balance. So you also want them to come to you and say, hi, so glad you're in here. If you have any questions, let me know. You guys with me? Type the number seven in the comments if that's the way you like to shop also. You don't want them coming at you all the time like, do you want this? Do you want this? Do you want this? Well, that's what social media is like if all you're posting is sales posts or about your business posts. That's, you're, you're, nobody is going to trust you or like you. They're thinking she only wants me to buy something. Now, here's the other part of that. If you don't ever do a post about what you do in business, nobody's ever going to buy from you. So it's that balance. I like to think of it like a boutique, how you walk in and you, they, you want them to look at you and be like, hi, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. Thank you for following me. And that's even approach you can do on Instagram and Facebook where a new person, you message them. You're like, thank you for following me. If you have any questions, please reach out. Let it go. Don't offer them a link. Don't offer them anything. They will get a hold of you. But then you post value, just like a boutique that everything looks beautiful. And even just going in there is pretty. Like where I got this dress, I love it. I like to even just go in there, even if I'm not in the mood to buy or don't want to buy anything right then because they treat me with respect. It's pretty to look at. I'll have my coffee and I'll just look around. It's pretty. So you want your stuff to be pretty. And this is why I talk about, like, if you come to my website, when I built it, I literally changed all the images to be something pretty. Like this is your online storefront. Are you guys with me? Type the number nine in the comments if you're with me. The biz pages, okay, nine in the comments if you're with me about everything looking pretty and you want your headers. And just so you guys know, I told you in here and I give you a little short rundown how to redesign your headers and your stuff today. So you want to watch this video today and get in there. Okay, another question. My biz pages, I have two are invite only. I have to add them. That's not a biz page. That's a group, Kim. You're, you're talking about a group. So just so you guys know, it's a business page. When you go create, there's a page and there's group. If you have to add them, you have groups and you gotta get a business page public ASAP, okay? There's a difference. Um, they, 
there's not invite only. When something's public, anyone can find it. That's the point. You want to be public. You want anyone to find it, right? Um, that's just the way it is. That's just the way it is, baby. Okay, got it. Can I love the questions? I don't know who you are, but I'm so excited. And you guys, this is what I mean about the internet. Like, you're seeing me do what you want to do, right? Like, you want to attract people, and you're like, I don't know who you are, but I like you. I like your questions. Let's get to know each other. Like, I'm a real person. You're a real person over there. These biceps are real today. I just didn't work out before. It's looking pretty good. <laughs> okay, any other questions? I will answer any questions. And if anybody wants me to review their Facebook page, I still have about five minutes here. I will answer your questions for five more minutes because this is the, you guys are getting the killer behind the scenes information right now on how you can really kill it. Here's what I would do if I were you. If I wanted to win that prize and I wanted to make sales this week, Here's what I do. I post 10 times a day. I'd schedule it all in that morning. And then I would also post one to two. I would schedule at least like eight in or nine. And then I would make sure during the day though, that I post a lifestyle pic. People like to know, Hey, today I'm at the gym right now. I'm lifting weights. They like to know like what you're doing today. Think of yourself like a celebrity. Okay. So, um, like the people you love to follow online, if you were like, I wish I knew what my favorite singer songwriter was doing today. Like what's she doing today? Think of that. That's how people are going to start to think of you. But first you have to hold yourself in that. Um, yes, your homework is to get a biz page set up. So Kim, make sure to watch the video you guys today. I explain the difference and I explain where to go. You need to make sure you have a business page and you'll have zero on your insights. That's okay. Today is just day one. This just leaves you a ton of room to grow. The whole point of all this I just want to say is like, today's a new day. Today's the day that you can turn things around. By Friday, you don't even know what you can do. I've had clients who've sold their first $500 using Facebook um, by Friday. And the second thing I do besides 10 posts a day, if I wanted to win, I would do up to $20 ad spend. I'd boost a couple posts. I'm going to teach about it. Wait till I teach about it. And I, the reason I don't let you go more than 20 is it's to keep it fair. And on top of that, I don't, I want you to see that with organic reach, meaning unpaid traffic means organic, like the posting I'm teaching you guys about, that's organic, and with a little bit of ad spend. And remember the ad spend if you're like, I don't have money for that. Okay, well listen, if you really don't have $20 or if you don't even have five, then don't get coffee. I'm serious, sacrifice your coffee. And if you know me at all, me saying sacrifice your coffee for $5 ad spend means I love my business because I love coffee so much. Here's the thing. My business changes my life. My coffee does not. Yes, it gets me through the day. You can make coffee at home that day. Spend that $5 and put that same debit card in to your Facebook ad account that you buy the, the coffee with, and you're going to see something happen because Facebook honors people who spend money. Okay, it's just the way it is. So we're going to talk about that this week. But I said, yeah, you can do this for zero, but you could spend $5 instead of buying a cup of coffee. Like my cup of coffee costs $5.75. <laughs> So don't get that for one day. Don't give me excuses in here. And um, watch what will happen to your Facebook business page. You can make that $5 back times a million. I mean, times at least like double it. <laughs> $10 something this week. Okay. So yeah. So any other questions before we go? Do you guys have any other questions? I am here for you if you have any questions. So again, make sure you, everything's in the group. You guys are ready to kill this thing. Oh, there's a question over here. Let me go see. Okay. Somebody asked, most of my business page friends are personal friends as well. Assume that by posting all of this, I'm not going to annoy all of my friends by posting too often. Thank you for asking this question. I'm not going to say who it is because you sent it to me privately. So I'm going to honor it. That. I'm like a doctor, a psychologist to Facebook. Okay, no, here's the thing. That's probably what all of you are wondering, right? Like, if I post this much, am I going to annoy people? Okay, this is why I believe that quote that I found is perfect for you guys right now. Here's the thing. If anybody is following you and is annoyed by your posting, they're not your real friend. Get them off your list. Just delete and block them. I don't care. <laughs> why wouldn't somebody want to, like, see your posts? If you're posting positive, fun stuff, do you know how many people message me like, I love your stuff. I'm not in business, but I love your stuff. Like, I, I don't even know how many people. And if they ever, if somebody ever posted to me that they don't, I don't even respond. I delete and block them. I don't care if they're an old family friend, family, or a friend. Because guess what? I don't have time in my life 
for people who think that I'm annoying to them. I hang out with people who love me, who appreciate me. Not always in the past, like, look, I had to draw some boundaries, but this is a great way to start to draw some boundaries. Um, let me see my new message over here. Did that help you? That's what the scroll button's for. Yeah, but I don't, I don't even give it power. And I don't talk about haters either. I don't believe in giving power to any of it. I'm letting you know, because you asked me a question how I handle that. Here's the thing. If you are so excited about what you're posting now, don't think about what anybody else thinks. You're just like, I can't wait to share this with somebody. Do you guys see that difference? Like, if you're like, I wonder what people are liking. No, no, don't even worry about that, actually. What you want to think about is, I am so excited to share this. This is within my niche. I love my coffee. I'm going to share this. And it's not about you being like selfie, selfie, selfie. It's about saying, hey, today I went for a walk to really ease my mind. How do you like to go? What eases your mind? It's this two-way conversation. And you know what? You're not going to know everything right now. Like, just try. But the point is the overall mindset should be like, fun. I like this. I'm only sharing things I love. And when you're finding things on Pinterest that you love, it could be a trip. It could be, so there's part of the things are on brand with your brand. And then part of the things are just fun because it's a part of you. So you're sharing a part of you and a part of things on brand. It's a mixture. Make sense? And that's why I gave you guys, I gave you guys all those uh, post ideas over there for that reason. Yeah. Okay, um, where is a question? Awesome answer, good. I hope that helped you. Um, I hope that you feel empowered. Do you guys all feel empowered? If you feel empowered to do this. So we're gonna go. Thank you guys for showing up live. Post any questions in day one. Post your insights, let's see them. Don't be ashamed, most people's are gonna be super low. Okay, I like it. I like, look, a lot of you are gonna start a new business page. This is a judgment-free zone. This is a positive-only zone. It doesn't mean you can't ask real questions. Those are awesome, real questions. Ask the questions, the things you're afraid of. Please, let's get it out there, let's be real. But I promise you I'm gonna have a solution and a positive spin on it for you is all. Okay, so let's be real with each other. Overcome your fears, overcome your anxieties, and overcome your laziness and excuses. Own your stuff, you're not a victim. And here's the rules that I like to live by, I will end this with. No complaining, no explaining, no justifying. Just go get it. That's why I love the whole Nike quote, just do it. Okay, you guys are awesome. I'm Tiana with inspiredmommyboss.com. I do special things going on this week. Just reach out to me if you have questions, not private message. Private messages for my VIP only clients. You can post a question though in the group. Um, if you do have a question for this week only, I, please just post it in the group and like help everybody else when I answer your question. And if a question requires me to do a screen share, I'm going to do that all week. You're going to see me answering every single question. I have a bunch to go through. Um, actually, right now, while I'm on here, I'm actually going to answer a couple more questions because in the group, somebody had posted a few questions. And so I'm going to um, post it there. I'm going to come into the group really quick and I'm going to answer these questions. It was um, from today. Oh, cool. We're already getting inside. Whoever did that, Emily, rock on. Okay. There was some questions. Okay. Here are some questions. Okay. Let me answer these real quick while we're on this screen share. If you need to go, you can go. But if you want to stay and if you also, I'm going to give this till, I'm going to give it just three more minutes. Okay. So I'm going to share my screen. I'm going to answer these questions. Okay, Emily asked, how many times a day do I really need to post to get good organic traction? It's three. Is that all seven days a week? Yes, always, always, always. And like I mentioned, five is better and ten is even better. Okay? Tiffany asked, just to clarify that three-page post a day and boosting something once a week. Tiffany, um, you can boost it way more than that. You can run full Facebook ads. It just depends on your budget. For this week, just don't spend more than $20 ad spend. So if you do a boost, um, try $5. A, B, test things. I'm going to be talking about that Wednesday or Thursday. How do you decide what message to put out there every day? Um, this is what I just told you guys about that's in the files, right? About, um, I, I do, I will tell you really quick visually, if you guys go to my Instagram, uh, come follow me and I'll follow you back, by the way. Tiana underscore transform. We're not doing Instagram, but I, I came up with this pattern for Instagram because Instagram is more visual and I follow this on my page. So just a heads up, here's what I do. And the reason I'm sharing this here is you can see it laid out. Facebook is more scrolling. As you can see, it's more like scrolly, scrolly, but I do follow this for Facebook. I do a video, a one minute video every day. I post that. I do a branded quote. I use Rona designs, R H O N N A. This is what I use for my, from my phone. 
and I make it myself. I just use the, uh, the text in an app, and then I do a lifestyle behind the scenes. You guys see what I'm talking about? This is a selfie, selfie, lifestyle, 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 selfie, lifestyle, branded quote, video with business tips. Okay, now the thing that I do differently on Facebook because it's a different sharing process is I share things from uh, Pinterest, like I mentioned. So I keep it really simple. I'm not scouring the internet, I'm scouring Pinterest and then I'm creating my own content using these other apps and Instagram. And then I come in, I take that same video and you'll see it if you go to my business page and you go to videos, you're gonna see these same things. So you guys see that? It's just laid out differently on Facebook. Does that make sense? Number four in the comments? It's a great question from Mary. Okay, let's go here. Out of 10 posts, how many should be biz related? Um, everything should be within your niche and authentic to you. But maybe um, in the call to action, only one. Only one call to action out of 10. Um, okay. Suzanne asked, how can I actually gain followers to my Facebook group? And I mentioned it here, but it's running ads, inviting people from your profile and page and engaging in their group. So what that means is like this, like I'll give a, um, a thing right here if I go to five day Facebook boot camp and I go there so I would grab this group link right here if you have a group you want to invite people to and I would come over here to my profile and I would say hey friends today is the last day to get in on the five day Facebook biz boot camp come join the group here. Now I have a longer term group uh, and I don't, I'm not gonna be teaching much group stuff this week. It's gonna be based on the page, but just since there was a question, I'm gonna answer it. That's one way. You can actually share this on Twitter too. Like, um, so just answering, the, if you have Twitter and LinkedIn, you can literally come here and I can go like that. I can tweet it and then I can come to LinkedIn. And this is what I'm talking about, how I like go across all platforms if you've ever watched my trainings. And I would go here and I would um, post that there as well. And LinkedIn. So now I just shared it to like over 20,000 people. Boom. <laughs> okay, but then ongoing is Facebook ads. But that's like a total really big process. It depends on the client. Facebook has changed their things about Facebook groups too. So we're going to focus mostly on pages, but I did want to answer that. How do we actually generate money from our Facebook page? That's a great question. There's several ways. Um, when you are in business, I know Anna, I did her branding. She has a store that's local. So she's gonna wanna do ads that, you could do an ad, Anna, that has a picture of an image like, hey, come in and get this right now or send me a message and you can order it. And then you wanna boost it. People, you're just not, are just usually not putting enough money into your, marketing. If you sell something, you need to be taking a percentage and putting Facebook ads, guys. Like, I'm telling you, your stuff, let me look at you in the eyes when I say this, it's a numbers game. So if, keep, if new people, you're, if you're either not going to Facebook groups, other Facebook groups, not spamming, that's the other part, that's a longer term process, or LinkedIn and Twitter and just keep inviting people every single day to your business page or to your group, it's going to dry up really fast. This is where Facebook ads, it's time or money investment. I'd rather invest even $5 a week or $20 a week to get more traffic into something. You guys with me? It's a numbers game. Type it in. It's a numbers game. If you're providing, what I'm teaching you right now is to provide amazing value. So when you run an ad or when organic reach, you're inviting friends. But that's going to dry up if, until you use ads. But the organic with ads is way more powerful than just an ad. Facebook rewards people who have organic reach, and Facebook also rewards people who have ads. Okay? So that's why we are going to talk about that this week. Okay? Great questions. And one last question, and we're going um, over here is... Um, Corey, I started my own office furniture and supply company, but typically a sales cycle takes much longer than just selling a few items. I don't know what you mean by that. I also have quite a bit of competition in my field, so I build relationships more than just being an order taker. Yeah, this is all about relationships. See, when you build value, that's what I teach also, Corey. Um, how can I use Facebook to improve those relationships or grow my funnel when the cycle takes so long? Okay, Corey, let me, let me thank you for posting this, and let me break through something for you right now. Um, everybody stay with me if you say so. Here's the deal. Part of this is that if you say that there's a lot of competition, then, then there will be. If you say that you have a long sales process, then you will have one. But if you deleted all that and rewrote this, Corey, and you said, 
Um, you know what? I'm open to learning how to create a faster sales cycle um, in, while growing relationships. That would be a way of like tapering that down for you that I would really recommend because life really is what you say. I'm not talking about denying reality. I'm saying if you know that building relationships is important, then that's why I'm sharing with you guys to really pour value organically, not just pay for ads. I could do a Facebook ad thing and be like, let's do Facebook. Mm -mm. I'm sharing with you when times are tight or tough, you can still bring in business organically by bringing value and building relationships. That's what I'm teaching you. But then when you got a five bucks here, 20 bucks there, a hundred bucks there, a thousand bucks there, pour it into ads in the right way. If you're going, if you have a thousand dollar thing, you definitely need to have some help if you don't know Facebook ads because you could just pour it all out and not know what you're doing. So I'm going to give you guys the very, very minimum basics of boosting a post, but I can't go into total Facebook ads because it's very customized. But what I can just say from the thing is watch your words, watch what you say. If you say so, so if you say that that's what your business is like, that's what it'll always be like. But if you say, you know what, I'm open to having a really faster sales process. I'm open to people really getting my vibe on Facebook and wanting to work with me right away. So be open to that, okay? So great questions. I'm gonna round that one around again, um, some of these brick and mortar businesses, but um, for now I have to go. You guys are awesome. Please feel free to message me uh, on here in our group, post your questions. I'm gonna answer everything. Have a great day. I can't wait to see you uh, on tomorrow's video. Bye.